The gloomy economy will be center stage at tonight's 85th annual burning of Zozobra in Santa Fe. Tens of thousands of people are expected to attend this year's destruction of Old Man Gloom. Crystal Gutierrez spent the day at Fort Marcy Park. From bank statements to glooms about the unemployment, event coordinator Ray Valdez says economic hardships helped fill this year's Zozobra. A couple I spoke with added another economic woe to the box today. You guys decided you're going to put something in the gloom box. Yes, IRS notice, but we're paying it, so it's good. Among other things. Now, even with the sluggish economy, event coordinators expect 20,000 plus people will attend tonight's event. They say ticket sales prior to the event were stronger than last year. The overly large crowd will come and watch what's become a tradition for many. A more than 50 foot tall boogeyman burning up glooms and dooms from the past year. Now, there's also live music and food vendors who say they hope they won't feel the economic pinch this evening. Billy Bowling says the event brings in a good sized portion of his family's income. Some of our events we haven't done as well but the people still do come out. People are still allowed to put their gloom notes into the gloom box for at least the next hour. The notes will then be put into the bottom of Zozobra. Among those gloom notes will be 600 wedding invitations. The woman that sent them also sent a note that said she will no longer need them because she called off the wedding. Crystal Gutierrez, KRQE News 13. Zozobra will begin burning around 8.30. Rain or shine, it will cost you $8 to get in at the gate. Kids under 10 are free. And you know there's going to be a huge crowd there. Right, rain or shine.